Welcome back to a new video. Finally, I have with me the new Hyundai Tucson hybrid version 2021 model and I will test drive it in this video. I will try to give you my impression about how is the feeling to drive and I heard about from my friend that already drive the car that you can drive the car around 35 kilometer only in electric mode if you don't drive faster than 80 kilometers so that's amazing to be able to drive this hybrid version so much and it's not the plug-in hybrid version it's just the hybrid version the plug-in hybrid version will come soon on my channel as well but first time we will test drive this car by the way if you're new on my channel just subscribe to my channel to see the all new videos that will come on my channel and it's free you don't have to pay nothing just click the subscribe button and you will see all the new cars and new notification that will be on my channel by the way is the vertex version is the full option version that you can get it and the price start at fifty thousand dollars uh, depend on the options also if you want to see the full review with this car uh, will be soon on my channel also i have it there on my channel the the normal version petrol version it's already there you can check it out today look on my channel you will see the video there but if you want to see this hybrid version will come in the next days probably next week subscribe to the channel to see the notification by the way when the video will be out and until then guys i want to give you some information so the car come with 44 kilowatt hour electric motor and 1.6 liter petrol engine and this petrol engine made 180 horsepower the electric motor make around 44 kilowatt hour and together the petrol motor with the electric motor will make 230 horsepower so that's more than enough power four wheel drive we have it right here and also it comes with all the latest technology 19 inch rims you can check them out uh, I will show you also in detail uh, the car in my review there you can see the trunk you can see the interior you can see the space you can see all kind of information about the car right there also it comes with a glass roof with leather amazing leather amazing quality on the car and also with the latest technology now let me show you the key this is the key right here guys it's a new key by the way let me go inside because it's super cold outside this is the key and if you buy the hybrid version of Tucson or plug-in hybrid version the car will come with two great features those features will allow you to summon the car forward and backward without you being in the car the same as the Tesla do uh, this is amazing not many cars these days have it and the same as Tesla you will be able to uh, park the car between two cars or uh, take it out depend uh, in which position you are and you can summon the car itself uh, with you outside so this is awesome and also I like this feature that you don't have it on other cars now also guys I want to show you something uh, of course the car come with all that latest technology uh, in terms of uh, keyless entrance start stop engine button and not only that let me show you something uh, but guys if you want to see all those kind of information about the car interior which kind of option it comes what it's doing every button what kind of materials are here you will see it in my full review uh, will be on my channel until then i want to show you the car come with this new uh, digital cockpit new multimedia system uh, a lot of usb port heated seats ventilated seats for you and passengers and you have this amazing something that i want to show you before we drive this camera 360 degrees camera when you press this button you will see right here guys uh 360 degrees around the car so you can see wh whatever is happening there you can go in reverse you can see you can park and drive the car uh and you can see those lines on the ground it will it will map up the ground for you uh, in the front in the back so you can park the car or drive the car super easy and this is amazing also no matter what speed you have guys the car come with this uh, view monitoring this is amazing for example when you turn the signal right or left you will see the camera because the car comes with 360 degrees camera it has a camera under the mirror there so you will see when you go left or right 
you will see no matter what speed you have you will see if it's a car there or no matter what is there this is amazing something that you don't find in other uh, cars so that it's really awesome also it comes with this shift by wire gear shifter it's, it's just amazing all you have to do just press these buttons uh, it's so simple so easy and i love those features now guys i guess that's for the beginning uh, if you want to find out more about the car, you will see it in my other videos. But until then, I guess we will start this um, test drive. So let's do it, guys. Right, guys so let's make a round about the car so you can see the car a little bit better before we drive it uh, as I said before this is the vertex version it's the full option version it comes with 19 inch rims also it comes in white I love the white colors because you can see a little bit better the lines of the car the design uh, and also yeah let's drive it guys the hybrid version i wait for such a long time this version here is the key by the way you see it before it's an amazing key and also it has this summon function that i told you before uh, all you have to do is just leave the key here inside the car i will leave it here on those amazing seats uh, the seats are really beautiful you can see this chrome design uh, the size of the seats are amazing you have side support i feel really comfortable being on those seats also the quality on the door if you hear it's very very good i will put my seat belt right now and get ready to drive also even the seat belt quality it feels really good when you touch it i like it it's a big improvement from the previous version huge mirrors great visibility around the windows i like the mirrors are super big you have blind spot technology in the mirrors as you see before blind spot technology also on the cockpit right here when you're turning the signals the cockpit visibility it's perfectly the car come with heated steering wheel right now it's heated and it feels so nice in the cold weather it's so cold outside everywhere it's it's warm and nice uh heated seats they are heated right now and i feel really good being here also the shift by wire here also guys here you have some buttons for driving terrain this is new on the tucson and from here you can change the different driving mode for example check this out we are in drive mode and you can change in eco mode or sport mode you can go in terrain you can drive on the snow mud or sand this is amazing uh, to be able to change all those features we will try to drive it in all those features right now you can see how much battery you have on the right side right there this is really awesome more than half battery we have on the car um, also you can see right here you can drive i think uh, you can drive only in electric mode i will show you in a moment i heard that you can drive only in electric mode uh, around 35 kilometer if you drive slowly not more faster than 80 kilometer so this is amazing to be able to drive only in electric mode um, also here you have this new multimedia system that i have a full review on my channel if you want to see it check it out on my channel uh, if you press this button here for the camera guys you can see also uh, the camera around the car that you see it great resolution on the camera it's an amazing three-dimensional system that you can use it while you are driving so it's a great great system also you have forward camera if you go and drive for example you can see the front camera up here here on the screen this is amazing and even when you go in the reverse you can see that you can park the car without any problem this is really really great also if you want to find out more about this car you will find it on my channel the steering wheel it's a huge improvement from the previous version i like the grip i like this this grip here this design the quality of the steering wheel it's awesome also the buttons here you can control different function on the cockpit you can see the consumption right there without any problem you can set it reset it uh, and you can see all kind of information from there um, and also you can change the lane assist you can activate it right now then autopilot you can see it there and also the distance between you and the car in front 
and the, the pedals you have pedals to change the gear manually if you want to change it manually you can see it right now I'm in EV mode you can drive in EV mode it will appear there an EV uh, and right now we are in EV mode also you have USB ports plenty of space in the glow box and also a big mirror nice visibility in the back as well and also you can see plenty of space for the passengers there anyway let's drive it guys this is the reason that we are here put it in drive and let's drive it it comes with electronic handbrake and also auto hold when you activate auto hold you will see it right there on the screen let's drive it right now we are in EV mode it's super silent I can wait that hyundai to make some electric suv i'm really really curious when we will do that so as i said before no matter what speed you have you can see on the camera right here the front camera and the side camera you look look how awesome how accurate it's show me that you have on the ground what you have on the ground you can see also there on the cockpit it's such a nice system i love it um, I love this system from Hyundai. It's one of the best on the market. I see the last days Mercedes come on the new S-Class with some kind of similar uh, system. And I have to tell you that Mercedes and Hyundai, they are the best in this moment at this kind of three-dimensional uh, system, 3D system cameras and parking. And this system, it's, it's beautiful. Now, I like the tall driving position. Um, I like the, the pedals, they feel super smooth and super soft um, and yeah, I like the way it feels at the first impression, good handlings. Right now we are, the engine is kicking, it's very cold outside and right now if I close, let me close this. I close the AC and we are driving on in electric mode. The car is super, super silent. You can see an EV mode there. And right now it's super silent. Also, um, if I'm not wrong, I will show you a little bit later when we go outside this little uh, city. I like how silent it is. I take some bumps and it feels really smooth over the bumps the car come with McPherson suspension in the front individual suspension and they are really good yeah let me try it here as you can see the car it's holding the steering wheel for me it's quite impressive right here I press the acceleration you immediately feel the engine it's kicking right now right now we are in EV mode it has a very intelligent system Check this out, the car will steer for me, how cool is that? It will warn you, put your hand on the steering wheel, but it's still keeping me between the lanes, super awesome. Right now we are in EV mode, the car will regenerate the energy. Wow, and the sound isolation, it feels like you are in a premium car. I'm quite impressed, you cannot hear so much noise from outside, here on the roundabout, it stays so good on the curves let me go out here for a second and I feel like the handlings are very good very good handlings we will try here the, the turning radius I'm really curious for such a big car it's quite good not bad not bad you can turn in small spaces it feels so agile this car even if it come with an extra battery a little bit heavier than the normal version that I drive it take those bumps without any problem it feels quite quite nice quite nice I'm quite surprised and even the petrol engine accelerate right here wow it feels great the pedals are super smooth and super soft as you touch it that's that's really good that's a good thing also if I go in sport mode right now we are we was in echo mode right now in sporting the car turning radius it's super good right now and in the steering wheel it's so so nice to, to control it's so silent And 
break amazing amazing wow great job it feels really good quality i think they did a, an amazing job uh with this car you know when it changed the gears you don't even feel it it has an amazing automatic gear shifter um it used the automatic one and i know so many people want to have an automatic gearbox on the car and this new tucson hybrid version it gives you the automatic gearbox not as the other um petrol version so um if you are in the market for automatic this tucson hybrid it has it and it works like a charm you don't even feel when it changed the gears right now wow it's so smooth so smooth and at high speed you don't you don't even hear the other cars so the sound insulation it's super good i was expect that i really was expect that from hyundai i know they make some amazing cars and i'm quite quite really pleasant surprise i really want to see what kind of electric cars they will come next because i really want to buy a car from them um, maybe my next car will be an electric suv from hyundai i was i was thinking so much before i buy my car um, my last cars i was thinking really serious uh, of buying a hyundai ionic electric and i was really really think about that because that car it's so good it's so good hyundai makes some amazing car in the last in the last time last years and i'm, I'm quite surprised to be honest really surprised and i i want to test this car also off-road sometime i think it will do some great job now we are in eco mode and you can hear the engine will change a little bit the, the gear will change a little bit faster and it will not wait so much until it's changing and right now when you drive in eco mode you have the, the perfect comfort you know uh, in terms of acceleration comfort quietness you don't hear the engine at all right now i'm driving in eco mode let's accelerate wow it's so smooth I can see on the screen when the car is going EV mode right now the car regenerate the energy and if I'm not wrong if I go here in setup and let me see on the screen I think the car have a regenerate screen I think here let me see here okay where is it? here right now you you have a great nice graphic right there that show you how much battery you still have and when the car is regenerate the battery back the, the energy back in the battery when you break and it's so cool it's so cool it show you when it use it right now it's used because i accelerate you can see with with um yellow and then with blue it show you right now the energy go back in battery wow it's a great system the koreans have so much experience with those hybrid uh, cars and hybrid versions of cars and i'm, I'm quite quite a pleasant surprise to see it on 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 this this hybrid system on this Tucson and you can see when I'm when I'm blinking you can see the camera all the time no matter what speed you have so smooth it's changing the gear super super smooth right now we are in fifth it, it has a six speed gearbox if I'm not wrong yes six speed gearbox fourth i can change from this those pedals if i want to drive sporty myself i can change the gears from here um i don't have to wait the car to change it for me i can go in third right now fourth fifth sixth yes i can change it myself so you can do it yourself from here if you want to do that you can choose um, that as well I don't know we have to drive 15 right here also by the way the car come with cruise control of course uh, I think you already know that I don't think it makes some sense to show you but you can set the cruise control from here you can put it up like that 50 
set it up press this button once cruise like this let me show you and then set it eight nine fifty and right now the car will will keep the distance for you also will keep the lane when it fills the lanes on the highway you can you can drive on the highway and the car will keep the lane will stay between the lanes very very good it's a great system even here in the city you can see that the car see the lanes there and for a moment it really keep it really well there um, yeah I don't want to go into detail without this cruise control but I have to tell you that it's work very very good right now again if we accelerate on the curves the handlings are really good right now you can see that it stays so good between the lanes so good right now in EV mode regenerate the, the consumption guy by the way I forget about the consumption let's go back to the consumptions where were I where is the consumption around here yes 7.9 liter and I drive with the car I did some acceleration as you see before I didn't drive uh, super 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 nice and smooth and yeah I'm quite surprised but I like the handlings I like how good it stay on the road the suspension feels so nice it's a nice combination between sportiness and comfort wow impressive 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 I like it and you have that torque if I go in sport mode right now in sport you have immediately that torque so 230 horsepower it's more than enough I think 350 Newton meters uh, it is more than enough for this car it is it's doing it's it gives you some so so much performance so great consumption right now 8.9 liter I'm sure if you drive really economical with this car you will get some gorgeous consumption for a huge SUV with a lot of tech a lot of space um, fifty thousand dollars it's a great price it's an amazing price guys i'm really impressed hyundai welcome to the premium world um you did a great job with this tucson i'm a big fan of the tucson i have to recommend this to all of you guys you have to test it if you don't believe me i, I think i really recommend you don't believe me i mean go and test it go and see the car you will understand what i mean when you will see the car i really really um enjoy it i really think this is a great car i think hyundai did a great job with it and well done well done well done i think this one it's one of the best car on the market today in my opinion uh in this class this tucson it's one of the best and what can i say it's i'm 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 done i'm really curious i want to test also the plug-in hybrid but i think i know how uh that plug-in hybrid will be and what can i say it's a great great surprise a pleasant surprise driving right now we are only in ev mode it's so silent so nice to drive it let's go in reverse look look how easy it is to, to, to park the car right here so easy so simple and it's so silent man i mean i like it i like it i like that the noise insulation inside the car it's very very good it's it's super good put it in park and we are done with this trip navigation the, the screen it's super responsive when you press when you put your 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 finger on the screen it's so so um easy and also the the sound inside the car it's very good you have here some nature sound you can change it that comes with the car ocean calm ocean waves rainy day open air coffee 
warm place snowy village oh yes it's so cold outside it's so cold outside today ah uh, great 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 and here is the hybrid information here you get some information about the car the consumption kind of the uh, average consumption and I have it on my screen 10.2 liters but I drive super super aggressive as you see before I like the screen it has such a nice such a nice uh, graphic and and resolution also the car can read the traffic speed limit has a camera up there and who oh, guys I hope you enjoy this test drive with the new Hyundai Tucson 2021 uh, plug-in hybrid it was a really pleasure driving this car it's an amazing car I'm super impressed with what Hyundai did with this SUV um, I was a, kind of a fan before on the previous version I like it I like how how reliable and how um, useful was the previous version of Tucson and so many people buy the previous version of Tucson and I think this one hybrid version and plug-in hybrid version it's just wow it's it's fabulous i mean i like it so much if i wasn't on the market for an suv probably probably i think 99 percent i will buy a tucson i like the new modern uh, exterior the modern interior i like the seats i like the technology and the price it's just fabulous. Also, it has five-star uh, safety rate, rating, uh, Euron Cup, and wow, what do you need more? I mean, it's really impressive car. Hyundai in 2021 is not the Hyundai that um, you know from uh, 10 years ago. Hyundai from 2021, it's a premium mark, and it should be between first five uh, marks today this is my opinion guys i hope you enjoyed the video uh, thank you very much for watching my videos to all of you if you like it please like it share it that would mean a lot for me also subscribe to my channel it's free you don't have to pay nothing just press the subscribe button and you will see also the notification when a new video will come out on market um thank you very much for watching if you want to see the full review it will come next on on my on my channel so if you subscribe you will see the notification if you like the music in the video, you have the link in the description. You can check it out there. Also, uh, I really appreciate uh, all your comments and all your um, support from you guys. Thank you to all my subscribers. And I read all your comments, really. Write me a comment, tell me what you think. If you have questions, ask me anything, I will answer to you.